Hello, boys and girls! My name is Hotzosti and welcome back to another episode in Minecraft. Do you remember this place? This is where our creeper farm is down there. And it's been a long time since this is in this ugly diamond shape, so it's finally time to do something about it. So I'm thinking huge time lapse and then I will see you on the flip side for some of the finer details of the bill. See you then! Right from the beginning when I uh, created this uh, creeper farm uh, I had the idea that decoration wise this would be a lighthouse because what else could you do for a structure out in the sea but then I uh, had another idea uh, and this will eventually uh, tie in nicely with uh, some other decorations we will build down the line and basically build an oil platform or actually I should say a spar platform because the, the usual oil platform they uh, have these four massive pillows that go all the way down to the uh, ocean floor um, on the uh, shelf and that's because the uh, ocean there is not that deep but uh, the uh, spar platforms are actually floating uh, on the uh, water and uh, are just anchored to the uh, ocean floor and uh, they happen to be in, in much deeper water and then they have just uh, oil pumps on the uh, ocean floor that connect to the to the platform and that's what we are building here uh, I don't know but a lot of uh, images that I have seen uh, have a, a yellow hull so don't know why that's it but uh, it is what it is so yellow hull and then on top there are some uh, floors um, that just uh, uh, are a bit of uh, building and a center structure and then on the uh, top there is a bit more variation where we have uh, uh, for one for the one side uh, a crane that can be used to uh, lift cargo out of uh, docked ships and onto the platform and then of course uh, uh, housing and work areas um, in uh, these kind of fashions um, and then of course helipad so to get uh, personal on and off the platform quickly and a small tank on top that can be used to as an as an entrance to the to the down below in the belly of the beast and initially I thought this would take quite a bit of time to build up in uh, in survival but uh, surprisingly it went rather smoothly so I did it first in uh, in creative and I would say um, uh, once I had gathered all the uh, materials, um, it 
took about twice the time to uh, build it up in uh, survival so uh, that's that's quite good I think uh, I also made sure that uh, everything is uh, spawn proof uh, that's important because we don't want to have any uh, uh, spawns uh, on this build which would lower the uh, rate of the uh, creeper farm down below. I also finished the decorations on the uh, outside now which was uh, mainly the uh, lower parts here with some chains and iron bars and also some uh, uh, piping and uh, made sure that uh, everything is uh, uh, spawn proof added detail here and there like uh, here on the uh, crane and uh, basically the uh, insides of these buildings are empty no use for that uh, but uh, on here in here if I can get in we have a way down to turn the farm off and on and uh, basically this uh, uh, has potential for the future uh, as we could uh, get the gunpowder gunpowder up here and uh, pack it into uh, shulker boxes and maybe also make a remote switch for uh, the turn for the for the clock down there so uh, I don't need to uh, get down there but this is it for uh, this episode Hope you enjoyed it. It was quite fun to uh, do this uh, bit of different build. And uh, I will see you in the next one. Goodbye!